Hello and welcome back to my channel and today we are playing Drogon We are continue with this episode So let's continue with this episode Okay So in the last episode we Daddy, come outside. It's a beautiful day. Why? So from last episode we have uh, We discovered something I, I do not know which is a ghost or I basically no, no, I'm just gonna check this phone first. Open. This is freshly cut. There's some letters over there. I can't read it. Oh. Yes. I can't read it yet. I don't know why. This song will be get copyrighted, so I'm just gonna keep it there. Or if it's get copyrighted, um, I will be muting that part. Kind of peaceful here, man. Now this is human being because most of the games when you open the door and it's locked and the person will say, "Oh, it's locked." Yeah, we all know it's locked. You know it's locked. You don't say it out loud. You say in your heart, like, "Okay, this is locked." You. In the monologuing, so you know it's locked. So you say in your heart it's locked. This is a, some kind of high tech shit. Now this is next gen shit. Just about giving up on you ever waking up. Oh. I was looking around the house. So we're okay with that now? Noted. Sleep well? I dreamed of Betty. She was in the garden. And she called for me. How about you, Lissy dearest? Oh, you know me, old fruit. Wide awake at first light. The Fretlands didn't come home, did they? They did not. There's no sign of anyone. Aside from last night's Miss Walker. I've been thinking about that. I... It was dark. Maybe I just saw a shadow. Chasing a shadow? That's very unlike you, old boy. Usually you scurry off in the opposite direction. I didn't get a good look. I'm not even sure there was anyone there. Well, there must be someone here. And I'm not talking about ghosts. Or goats. What was it you said yesterday? Oh, Maybe they're peeking yesterday. at us through the windows. I'll take a gander. The Fretlands will be home soon. And Betty's here. Where are you going? Edward, I'm talking to you. Wait, just, just, just wait a second. Uh -huh. And Betty's here. 
I know it. I feel it. If you say so, Teddy Bear. Have you had your noodle juice yet? I'm not rummaging through their cupboards. You'll be a pill without your tea and toast, old bean. We need to get you sorted. I'm not hungry. First point on the agenda. Find the natives. A mission! Hot dog! I'll scout ahead. I'll meet you down by those houses. Let's uncover your secrets, Gualvik. Okay, ah, uh, said it something. Okay. What should I do now? Turn the map. Where's the map? OBI. I'm pressing. Lissy! Right by the village houses! Okay, okay. I'm pressing every button that I can, and I found that, that button. It's such a beautiful day. You could bottle and sell this air in Boston. It's frankly medicinal. Careful you don't fall. You suck the fun out of everything, old boy. We're far from any doctor. I don't want you to hurt yourself. That's not very likely, is it? I thought you were scouting ahead. What do you think I'm doing? Vantage point, like on a pirate ship. I can probably see our house in Hanover from here. Did you check those buildings? Knocking on doors isn't a scout's job, old queen. Lissy. I'm not shouting, cat damn. Hello? hello? Anyone here? Why, hello, Mr. American. Please come in for a cup of tea and biscuits. You're not helping. Also, they drink coffee here, not tea. No one home? Hello? Who? Who's there? Hello? Anyone home? Hello? Hello? September 21st, 1923. The air desperata. Lissy, found something here. Escalated from words to stones. Blood has been spilled. The curse haunts us all. There is no hope left in Good Sparata. Good. God. Right. In this godforsaken place. The death of the Jiminy. Death of the children was the end of Grovik. Whatever remained of our souls departed with them. You should see this, Lissy. The letter just trails off. It was never sent. What is this? Did you see this door closing? It was just the wind, Teddy Bear. You're as skittish as a pussycat. There's one more house. Third time's the charm. I will kick you in the stomach. Don't. Don't make me dizzy. Why are you are so acrobatic? Come on. Anyone home? Unless they're playing hide and go seek, I'd say that's a no. Three strikes, you're out. I don't think anyone's been home for a while. Someone painted the word traitor on one of the doors. And there was a letter. It sounded foreboding. Well, you were wrong. The villagers are not indoors. I saw some sheds down by the water. There's the general store. The church. In other words... Time for some sightseeing? Well, it's a bright and beautiful day, and we have nothing better to do. What on earth are you doing? Just Handstands, Teddy! My record is two minutes. I'm working on three. Just go on ahead. 
I'll catch up. Betty would have taken plenty of constitutionals here. She loves the outdoors. How so? Hmm. Where am I supposed to go? Give me some clue. This girl is doing some handstand. By the water. Oh, yeah, shit. By the water down here. Beautiful. What if everyone turned into a pebble? And they can't speak. What's what this? The Remnants of the mining operation. What? Mine? There was a mine here, but it closed down 20 years ago. I was just checking for a sense of humor. Yeah, that's not to be funny about. Where do these tracks lead? To the mine. Where else would they go? I don't know. A castle up in the mountains? Where the frost giants live? And this is how they were hmm. I do not know how to get there. Oh, okay. I think by these better water. A boat! Teddy! A hot dog! This is our ticket out of here! Not without Betty. How about we don't go back to Hanover and stay here instead? And they had a memorial service for the accident in the mine. On July 24th, in the village church. For something that happened 20 years ago? It still affected their lives. The telegraph is out of order. Well, there goes my plan. N-O-S-O-S. -S. This was two years ago, but the notice is still up. How can it take two years to get something like that fixed? If they couldn't afford it? Or couldn't get anyone to come fix it? Well, this place really is off the map. Here be dragons. Or dragons, I guess. Oh, that's what I meant. Yeah. The ferry route is no longer operating. Rats! Mrs. Fratland already informed me in her letter. I know. Still warrants a resounding rats. I wonder why it stopped running. Look around. How many people live here? 20? 30? That can't be enough for a ferry route. Things got quieter after the mine closed down. Yes, they need to do. move on and find something else to put their village on the map. Mm, a tobacco farming, maybe. Let's check this shop. Yes. Ah, applesauce. Why ah. lock any doors? I can't imagine they have a problem ah. with punks and hoodlums. The sign says they're club. Is that? Lizzie, come here. It's Betty's hat. She was here. She could still be in there. No, she's Betty? Uh, Betty! Are you sure, Edward? I mean, it's just a hat. Is it even a hat? I'm I know sure my I... sister's hat, Lizzie. I have to get inside. What about the breaking and entering part? I could care less what they call it. This is open. Here's an open window. <laughs> you seem eager to break the law. I approve. It won't budge. Nah, don't be a milk toast. Well, it's stuck. Attaboy, Teddy. You can do this. I can't believe I'm actually breaking. Whoops, Daisy. Oh my, Teddy. <laughs> You're such a sap. I can't get up. Edward Charles Hart. <laughs> Tanty. World traveler. 
cat burglar. A cat burglar would, by definition, enter a building Jeez. on a higher floor. The state of this place. Oh, Betty. Edward. I hope you weren't here when... Is this... blood? Not necessarily human blood. Well, that's all right, then. What, what does it that? say? Barn murder? Someone murdered a barn? Why? Why that is so stupid? Damnation. The hat's in here. Calm down, old boy. Barn means child. And murder, that's... Child murder. Edward. They murdered a child? Someone thought so. Probably the same someone who vandalized the store. Who knows what else is in here? There could be more clues. All right. Okay. Everything's Jake. We made it into the store. I'm sure we'll find a way through that door. Why would Frederick keep a list of what he calls traitors? What did they do to him? Cross him in some way. Why else keep a shit... Uh, a list of undesirables? Been fixed. Perhaps there wasn't much demand for it anymore. Ute, 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 Av, or S. O. S. Ute, Av, Trif. Oh boy. If only this thing worked, we could order a boat to come get us. Or, even better, order some hot grub. Yeah, they even have. Yeah. Okay, must be a key somewhere here. What are you doing? Looking for keys. Your life of crime? The keys are all gone. Some thieving thieves beat you to it. Rascals. There's a note. Is it written in Viking runes? What does it say? It's from Simon. Yai put it means Yai. I put. Nurkel is key. Casa. I don't know what that word means. He put the key in the casa? Casa. I wish I had my dictionary. The note's addressed to his father. So the key was moved. But where to? Somewhere safer. Or more convenient. Can we really trust your translations? You only started studying a month ago. I spent the summer reading. And I had a lot of free time on the ocean voyage. Come on, how much could you possibly pick up in a few months? You know my mind, it's a sponge. These were never sent. How long have they been piling up? I received Mrs. Fretland's letter in June. A couple of months. Perhaps the world forgot about Grovik. Yeah, they said it. The world forgot about... Casa. So that's what it means. Cash register. Oh, get right click, yes, move. Wow. You're a genuine gangster now, old fruit. Don't worry. If you get busted, I'll come visit you in the big house. Wasn't there supposed to be a key? Here it is. It's a fucking key. Don't look at it like that. You just pick it up and put it in your pocket or hold it. It's only use at the door. It is her hat. Teddy, I'm not Betty sure that's... Betty was here, but not long ago. Okay, but if that is her hat, what's it doing in a locked storeroom? Another breadcrumb. That's not an answer. I know for sure she was here. That's what matters. You know best, Edward. So, what now? If this is a breadcrumb, where's the next one? There must be a reason her hat's in this room. There's a letter under it. Let's What's read that? it. Please. A handwritten note. Not blind. What does it say, you silly goose? 
It's hard to read. I'm not sure my translation will be. Johan, you... Nectar. Refuse. You refuse to speak to me, so I write this letter instead. It's from Frederick Fretland to his brother. Uh, Simon did not... Bloody hell. Simon did not murder your Ruth. He was fond of his cousin. Ruth? Ruth is the daughter of Anna and Johan, which means... The little girl in the photograph at the farmhouse. She's dead. Oh, Edward. The Fretland girl was murdered. This is simply awful. Simon was working at the farm while I tended to the store. I would have seen him had he passed on the way up to the cliffs. They thought Simon killed Ruth. His own cousin. Ruth was... What's that word? Playing. Ruth was always playing on the rocks below the church. She must have fallen by accident. The note ends there. Frederick never finished it. And Johann never read it. Not that it would have made a difference. Like if Johann thought... The mob showed up for Simon. His father would have tried to protect him. September 17th. You would have been here, Betty. Rocks below the church. Isn't the church right above us? Edward, come look at this. That's the cliff, right there. The one in the note? I bet you a million clams. Where? See for yourself. Where? I guess that could be where. Let's check it out. No, Lissy, wait. Doing. This doesn't concern us. The little girl died. We're staying in her home, for God's sake. Are you completely without heart? Get yourself up here, Edward Harden, right this minute. Come on, it's an easy climb. This looks very dangerous. Oh, you're a big boy. Start acting like it. It's not Mount Everest. I don't. <laughs> whoops a daisy. Who the fuck said whoops? I, I, I. It, it, it's your thing. I don't want to. Bash on it or anything. What is this? Where little Ruth died. You're being mm -hmm. morbid. Mm -hmm. And this is a distraction. I'm here for Betty, not because some girl Edward, got herself. You insensitive brute. You're like the tin woodman, no heart. You know, you've grown cold and mean in that horrid study of yours. With only books and bugs to keep you company for years and years and years. There are other people in this world, you know. It's not all about you. You're going to do this. If not for Ruth, then for us. We're going to figure out what happened to the poor girl. Together. Okay. Something struck this bush. She must have landed on it when... on her way down. That's ghastly, Edward. It's a long fall. Far enough to crush the girl's skull. Edward Charles Harden! What? Oh, you're hopeless. You said being a detective. I'm being a detective right now. I'm being Sherlock. Is that blood? The girl could have hit her head on that rock. There would have been plenty of blood. That's awful. That's been here a while. Didn't you say it happened over a month ago? You'd think her family would have replaced it with fresh flowers. Where the family is missing. Where are you going? Well, then I'm oh, you can add. Okay. Teddy, what? Um. Okay, the rock is finished. The fall is finished. Where's the other clue? I've seen all there is to see. I'm going back. You can't leave. We might have missed something important. All right, now I don't see anything important over here because there's no that. Damage, flowers, 
rats. And that's it. That's it. The four. That's why I'm going Where are you up. Going? There's nothing to, to see over here, man. Look at this. Something struck this book. Is that hmm. blood? That's been here a while. Didn't you say it happened over a month ago? You'd think her family would have replaced it with fresh flowers. Where are you going? I do not know right now. I'm clueless. It's a long fall. Far enough to crush the girl's skull. Edward Charles Harden! What? Oh, you're hopeless. Well, that's it. Am I missing something? I'm a guy that can zoom my eye. Holy shit. I've seen all there is to see. I'm going back. You can't leave. We might have... Where are you going? I'm going somewhere that I need to be. Up there. Investigating this thing. But this game doesn't let me. Where are you going? I do not know. I do not know. Okay? I've seen everything over here. Everything. Every fucking thing. Alright? All right. Where are you going? Shut it. Teddy, where are you going? Shh. Oh. What more details that I'm missing? There's nothing. Ah, damn it. Okay, Google time. Oh, man. I just want to get up here, but the game that the game doesn't Teddy, want me to. Where are you going? Shut up, shut uh, up, shut, shut up. There's nothing over here. Look. It's a goat. I told you it's a goat. Okay, uh a lot of it. Ooh. Okay, uh, there's a door behind there. Well, uh, a lot of the walkthrough told me, a lot of the guide told me, like, not expect the rock, inspect the rock last. So I did a boom boom, I did a mistake over there. I did a mistake Is over there. Is that blood? A girl could have hit her head on that rock. There would have been plenty of blood. That's awful. I think there's something behind it. Can you move the rock aside? Okay. It's a dog with no head. It must be Ruth's. Where's the head? Maybe the killer also decapitates dolls. Oh, Hold on. This pin. This is old. Very old. It looks like something from the... From the Viking era. We are in the land of Vikings. This could be a thousand years old. It does not belong in a child's doll. Who cares? Ruth is dead and you're obsessing about a rusty old pin? Let's go further out. Maybe we'll find more clues. Come on, old sport. It's not far. Can you wait just one minute so that I can catch my... breath? Huh? Did you follow the same path, Betty? Or am I just stumbling through darkness? You can see clear beyond the edge of the world. Uh, one... 
Oh, Second. teddy bear. <laughs> we need to take you out walking more <sighs> often. So, the girl fell from up here. Was pushed, you mean. Can you see where she fell? Seeing as you're so concerned about me falling out of trees, I wouldn't want to risk falling off a cliff. If she fell headfirst on that rock, she'd have died instantly. Edward! Honestly! You wanted to learn more. This is you learning more. She hit her head and fell into the bush where I found her doll. Happy now, Alice? I'm not. What was she doing up here in the first place? Playing? She was a child. Children play in dangerous places. There must be more to it. Let's find out where this path leads. No, absolutely not. <sighs> I don't have time for this nonsense. We're running out of daylight, and Betty's still... You're still out there. Lissy! Slow down! I can't keep up with you. Who knows what's up there? It's not worth the risk of falling and... breaking something. Lissy? Are you there? What, what would you look at? Teddy. My word. Uh, look away, Lissy. Is this what happened to the villagers? They killed themselves? It's one body. Let's not jump to conclusions. Uh, what does that say? God forgive me. Don't suicides go to hell? Isn't that what your father said when Stop. your mother drowned Don't. herself? Sorry. Who was he? One of the Fretlanders? It's not Johan or Frederick. And he's too old to be Simon. Do you think this has something to do with Ruth? Maybe she came across the hangman before she died. And it scared her. So she ran no. and... This happened later. There's some consolation in that, I guess. Maybe it's the killer. The guilt ate him up and he offed himself. That's just speculation with no basis in fact. There's nothing more to do here. I'm going back. Let the poor soul rest in peace. Does it look like he's resting in yeah. peace? You're just going to leave him hanging? You're an insensitive brute. I'm here for Betty. This is... It's... Tragic, but really none of my concern. Oh, Betty, 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 always just Betty. You don't care about anyone else. What if that was me up there? Would you care then? All you do is obsess over a scarf and and a hat and ugh. It's all I have of Betty. Betty, there she is again. Edward, look at me when I'm talking to you. Whoa, okay, that, that, that's me. Anyway, Edward, that, that, that's me. the hanged man, he's someone. No matter what he did or didn't do, he deserves respect. Would you please just do this one decent deed? If not for me, then for yourself. Or for... For your Betty. What are you doing? You can't just pull him down by his legs. Try loosening the noose. I can't reach that far. I'm going to be sick. I can't do this. Yes, you can. Teddy. Come, come up here. Edward. I know you can. You've been through much worse. Edward. It's been two days. 
If they're not back tonight... They're not coming back. Perhaps they left after their daughter died. Was murdered, you mean? Isn't that what we think happened? Penny for your thoughts? Perhaps she fell by accident. So you don't think it was murder? It's difficult to say with any certainty. The boy could have pushed her. You're really not helping. Can we talk about this tomorrow? I'm sorry. You're exhausted. I, I buried a corpse today, Alice. I know. I'm sorry. Why don't you sleep in the guest bedroom? The couch is fine. The fretlands could still come home. All right. Just don't come crying to me if you wake up with a crick in your neck. I'll be up for a while, if you feel like talking. Well, the frame rate is dropped somehow. What did you find? Someone tried to burn this. Just like the book. Isn't that odd? It's addressed to Mrs. Fretland. My dearest Anna. It's from her sister, Margaret. I really shouldn't. Really? How else are we going to figure out what happened? Keep reading. My dearest Anna, I miss you so very, very much. The baby is due soon, and I wish for our family to reunite before... Uh, da, da, da. It's been seven years since the dreadful incident at the mine. Can we not convince Frederick and Johan to forgive and forget? I know there are things Frederick has not told me about what they found and why they parted ways. Their grudge is tearing us all apart. Frederick won't even let me speak to half of our neighbors, accusing them of treason. Uh, he's so very angry and full of regrets. It's eating him up. And we... And we what? The rest is unreadable. Margaret reached out to her sister, but I guess it didn't work. This was written before Simon was born, but burned recently. God, I thought somebody else outside. Do you think Simon killed Ruth? It's not important what I think. I don't know what to believe. Sometimes children do monstrous things. Oh, that is true, though. The two brothers married twin sisters, Anna and Margaret Taylor. That's the Grovic <laughs> Stave Church behind <laughs> them. Like All those hopes and dreams like the guys. ground to dust by misfortune. That is weird. Where's the couch? What are you doing? Betty will want these back. I don't think it's healthy. Not now, to... please. I'm exhausted. Quite the day, huh? I'm ready to pass out. Where will you sleep? Uh, I'll be up for a while. My mind's simply racing. Don't stay up late. Wake me if you hear the Fretlands arriving. Of course. And I'll keep my eyes open for any ghosts that might want to hide. Okay, my assumption is that Alice is there. No. Hush now. Sleep. <laughs> because. Uh, Alice is not interacting with us at all, just interacting with the objects and the objects not moving. Like she's sitting on a chair and the chair is not moving at all. She went outside and the door isn't open at all. That's what I think Alice is, so, is dead. Well that's it for today's videos I guess because uh, I will be seeing you dudes in the next video dude. Peace out.